In this video, we will learn about the stored program computer architecture. But before beginning the video, let's understand what is program and computer architecture. So the program is a set of instructions provided to a computer to perform a particular task. While a computer architecture is the arrangement of the components which determines how computer software and hardware join together and interact to make a computer work. The stored program computer architecture is a computer design in which both program instructions and data are stored in a single memory unit. Here, the CPU retrieves instructions from the memory and executes them in a sequence. A program counter PC which is present inside the central processing unit keeps the track of the memory addresses of the next instruction to be executed. In stored program computer architecture, the instructions are stored in linear sequence of memory locations, that is, one after the other. Additionally, the data used by a program is stored in the memory unit and can be accessed by the CPU through the memory addresses. Which means, the CPU reads the instructions from the memory decode them to determine the meaning of the particular instruction and also execute it. Here, the program instructions include operations such as arithmetic, logical and control flow instructions. The control flow instructions are the instructions which are used to change the order of the non-executed statements. The stored program computer architecture is basically used in modern computers such as servers and supercomputers. Now, let's see the working of the stored program computer architecture. So basically, the memory unit is divided into two parts, instruction memory unit and data memory unit, whereas the central processing unit has its own memory for processing. Here, the CPU reads the instruction from the instruction memory unit. The data used by a particular program is stored and retrieved from the data memory unit, while in case of CPU, it executes the instructions and processes the data. Initially, the CPU retrieves the instructions and data from the respective memory units and then execute instructions and store the result back in the data memory unit if necessary. So, in conclusion, we saw what is stored program computer architecture where the stored program computer architecture is used and it's working. Thank you.